We're now joined on the line by Mr. Tony Benn, who is a member of the UK's Labour Party. He's joining us now on the line from London. Sir, thanks a lot for joining us. Now, what does uh, the UK gaining ground in the country mean for Britain? Well, it is a reflection of anger among a lot of people at what is happening. And um, it is uh, directed partly at the Conservatives, partly at the Liberals, partly at Labour. And it is an indication of uh, the serious economic situation facing the world. And, Mr. Ben, is it simply just the economics here, or is it also to do with a foreign policy, you know, the fact that the UK now, for example, uses drones to attack Afghanistan? Well, I think there is an, an element of uh, international policy involved, certainly as far as Europe is concerned, because UKIP, this uh, new party that has uh, grown up, is very hostile to Europe, and uh, a lot of people feel that in this situation that we're in, uh, the control of British policy by Europe is damaging to our interests. And so, Mr. Ben, where do you personally then stand on EU membership and whether the United Kingdom um, does gain any advantage from, from being part of the EU? Where what? Uh, where do you stand on, how, on, on the UK's membership in the EU? Well, I think I was opposed to Britain joining the European Union in 1975. And uh, I think uh, the criticism I have of it is not hostility to Germany or Italy or France. It is uh, the fact that uh, Europe is not run by elected people, but by appointed people. And we, the world at the moment is dominated by enormously powerful international economic organizations. Uh, and uh, they are running the world uh, to suit the interest of the rich. And uh, I think the European Union is a part of that problem. All right, we'll have to leave it there for now. But of course, we do appreciate your insight. That was Mr. Tony Benn, member of the UK's Labour Party, speaking to us live on the line from London.